Hey guys, welcome in and welcome back to another Black Myth Wukong episode. We're on episode 18. I heard that I Buddha know. planted watermelons here hundreds of years ago. One bite grants prolonged life. Yet, when the cold bites all around, without your powerful spells, there's no way I can find it. Or out dodge them. Even with multiple. That's weird. Okay, so I wasn't hungry for anything. That looks like vines. Does he give hints on where it could be? Someone once saw a chubby boy jump from the cliff with a watermelon in his arms. He rushed to the edge of the cliff but saw no movement down there. Seemed like certain death. But suddenly, he heard the boy laughing from beneath, on and on. Bewildered, he fled from the cliff. This story may offer a clue for my treasure hunt. Maybe the watermelons were planted under the cliff. Don't let me keep you, sir. I will leave by myself when I feel warm enough. A clue from maybe the watermelons were planted and don't let me keep you, sir. I will leave by my this maybe the watermelons were planted under the cliff. Ah, here we go. Time and again, I tested you, and I saw nothing but gullible goodness. <laughs> Our brother does misjudge as well. It requires no effort to trick you. You will never be the destined one. Let me help you end your sorry life. That was rough. Clearly, better choice. Or face your downfall. Oh, that's all right. I think it was the blue dude. Nothing more. Really I've done hard. as our brother asked. Till we meet again. has led you here <laughs> rest easy you won't find those noisy chantings and pain screamings here hmm. <sighs> a nice 
ripe melon. Mm. Want a bite? Mm. Mm. It's better than you think. Sun Wukong used it to trick that disciple of mine. Come. Come closer. Now you've found this place, I'll teach you a trick neither of them knows. Your hand. Find spells, vessels transforms to enhance attack. <sighs> hmm. Spellbinder. It hurts no foe, but binds yourself. You'll come to understand its use. An old friend of Sun Wukong came to me, wanting some peace. I led him to the Great Pagoda. Have you paid him a visit? <laughs> they say you are the destined one. But if destiny is set, what difference do our actions make? While active, the emits a glow binding you. Da -da -da -da. When confronted, the formidable foes capable of restricting spell casting. Okay, so this might help with yellow brow. with the grabbing. Now I can go home. Who are you? Uh, uh, what's the difference between life and death? For we... Back so soon. Give it to you. I'll get to... I went on break right here and forgot to change it from the BRB screen, so bear with me. Let's uh, clear out the temple. So I'm still not sure where the fox is supposed to go. I'm not understanding this, I think. So confused right now.
Your um, belly's on fire. Though. Your belly was on fire. Alright, so I still don't know how Spellbound works. Like, it doesn't make sense to me. <laughs> Still spellbound. My friend, Yellow Wind Ridge offered me nothing. Yellow Brow, the Buddha, was my next plea. Only after meeting his grace in the new west did I see. I wasted my life for others and missed much joy. No more journey now. My king is suffering, yes. But does one not weave the threads of one's destiny? Peace is... Let his grace speaks true. Indulge, and you shall be carefree. This joy, it's... Ah. My king once sought wisdom in such a Dharma place. His son, too, was a disciple of a Bodhisattva. Now I, too, walk on this path. So, my friend, why don't you stay here and tread this path with... Ooh, another gourd. When the gorge is full, the first sip replenishes full health. Ooh, that's kind of nice. I found another meditation spot. I think. Or I just found something. How do I get rid of this spellbound? What'd I get? What'd I get? Oh. I was kind of wishing there was a save spot because I still don't know how to use this soul bound. The <coughs> spellbound for this, um... I wonder if I knew there was something. For years, I prayed you'd find peace. Still, you come to take my life in penance against yours. You wouldn't understand my agony when I took your life. The Buddha sees no such Vengeance. He grew. He just shall grew. Usher you to the beyond once more. Mm. Can you? Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the number. What gulp I do? <laughs>
Okay, I didn't need spellbind. Nothing, not even the scriptures, can bring me from this tree. Uh, the nature of your gods is beyond remedy. I've brought this upon myself. So there might be a meditation spot at the very end, but usually after you defeat the like main boss of the area, it's usually not there. Has this always been here? Just never notice it. If I go back, is that fox there? Could I talk to the, like, to turn in? Like, because I defeated? We didn't really talk to the fox again. They say mortals and Yao Guai's walk different paths, but it's after seeing him again that I understood. Those who fear Yao Guai's are fouler than what they fear. Attempt. I gotta remember everything. The destined one. What a glorious name they bestowed on you. The destined Needs to get done on. I wanted to hop in here and just say thank you guys for making it through the video. I know the videos have been getting shorter or more condensed, and I'm trying my best to condense and leave out all the parts where I'm just kind of fighting the ads. Thank you so much, and see you in the next episode. If you want to watch it live, you can find me over on Twitch, Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Bye.